Hello adventurers! Today we are exploring Jasper AI some more where I'll show you how to get it to write exactly what you want. And today we want an essay. So first, get on the application and open up a new document. Title it, the title of your essay. And then we'll begin. to write the context of your essay. This is a sentence or two describing the context of the essay you want it to write. This includes information such as why the essay is written, what the essay is for, what the essay is about, how you want the AI to write it, and the tone you want it to write in. For this essay, our title will be Ethics of Artificial Intelligence, and our context will be this is an essay to be written about the ethics of artificial intelligence and how it is used. It is made for a university assignment and must be detailed and eloquently written. Do note that I don't actually have an assignment with this title, so this is just an example. And now we need to gather our points that we will talk about. And for this, I'll borrow three points from this website on AI ethics issues. Now that we have our points and our context, we can go on to generate an introduction. The three asterisks are used to block out various sections so the AI doesn't see beyond that. We can now pick the points and the context, put them in the introduction section and write up a command. If you try to run a command in Jasper, there is a character limit that you can't exceed with it. By declaring a command like this, you can tell it to run the command later, and the command can be as long or as short as you want. Now we can type in carry out the command to do the command. Here it generated a pretty good result in the first try, but if it doesn't work out, you can always either click the dislike button to get a refund and try again, or click the redo button to do it again. Now that the introduction is done, we can make another divider and continue on to generate the body paragraphs. For the first one, we take the first point and copy it into the section and mark it under the name of topic. We can add more detail to the topic we are describing so that we get the desired result and cut and paste the context and put it here too. Then we can go on to write another command for generating a body paragraph. If you wish to follow along with what I'm doing, the full document of this will be included in the description below, and the completed essay will also be included there. as long or as short as you want and you can be as creative as you want with them. So really, the only real limitations of this is your imagination and how you craft the commands and what information you give it.
for the second and third point, we treat it similar to how we treated the first point and we transfer the topic over, add more details and copy and paste the context over before we use the command. The command can be the same as we used for the first topic and then we just run the command and wish for the best. If it doesn't work out, we can always redo it until we get the desired result. Now that the whole essay is done, the last thing left to do is to compile it all into a cohesive essay with the introduction, body paragraphs, and the conclusion. This is also the time for proofreading, as the AI does make some mistakes from time to time, and there will be various inconsistencies that need to be ironed out. Here you can see me transfer all the content that we need onto a separate document. This is the, the document that would be submitted if we were going to give it to someone. or anything in between, be sure to put it down below and let me know. Otherwise, the content that I made, this essay, is also down in the description. 
or on my website if you would like to visit me there. Thanks for watching. See you next time.